New at 6, a community center is forced to close its doors in Sacramento's Del Paso Heights neighborhood because of the recent storms. As ABC 10's Candace Red explains, it's a big loss for the most vulnerable who rely on the center for everyday support. It's flooded inside. Strong storms recently damaged a beloved community center on Clay Street in Sacramento. The wind blew the ceiling partially off and a lot of rain um, entered uh, into our building. The nonprofit Neighborhood Wellness uses the building to help the most vulnerable communities each day. When this storm takes away that opportunity, it impacts so many people um, who aren't able to come here and get the support that they need. It means everything first of all to me. Sherry Kirklang, who lives in Del Paso Heights, says Neighborhood Wellness changed her life. Because I was a person who went through trauma. While growing up, Kirkling says she faced hardships. Came from an abusive home, never got healing from it, went on drugs, stayed there for a while, had children. Then I realized that, hey, are they worth it? Got my life back on track. Kirk Lang says she eventually found healing by working with the organization. It helped me to understand me. So it was like a therapy place for me. When people have uh, childhood adversity, it impacts them through adulthood. Dr. Gina Warren says she co-founded the nonprofit in 2015. To disrupt intergenerational trauma and poverty, specifically in Del Paso Heights. It helped me to understand that things that happened to me in my life weren't always my fault. Warren says the storm caused thousands of dollars in damages. We have insurance that will cover that, but um, there's going to be a lot more uh, things that we're going to need to cover. It was just getting really good better and better and better month after month. But then I realized that uh, the building doesn't do the work. We actually do the work. And that was our Candace Red reporting. Neighborhood Wellness serves about 60 people each day. The organization is going virtual and straight into the community until repairs can be made at the site. You can help by making a donation. For more information, visit abc10.com. Here at ABC 10, we stand for you. We made a list of resources to help you deal with the aftermath of the storms and to prepare for even more rain. Just text the word STORM to 916-321-3310. We'll send you everything you need to know straight to your phone. And be sure to download the ABC 10 app. It is free and you can track conditions where you live. We are also linked to the National Weather Service. So any important weather statements like the tornado warning from earlier this week or severe thunderstorm warnings will get sent right to your phone from the app, keeping you and your family safe. Next